folding and folding like a letterbox. What do you say when you just can't talk? Good morning. Welcome to another vlog. So it's Saturday. It's around 10 o'clock. Um, I just made myself a coffee and I'll be reading. So it's kind of my routine on the weekends in the morning, as you've probably seen in my previous video, if you watch it. Anyways, today I'm supposed to have quite an exciting day to go to Sky Garden with my sister and do some work uh, for my clients. However, there's like pro-Palestine march protest going on in London in the afternoon so it will be absolute nightmare to then get home so we skipping that which is annoying because I thought finally I'm gonna have some exciting vlog for you and you know show you some parts of London etc but that's not happening so I don't know really what to do because if I knew it I realized I literally yesterday evening that was happening because I had yesterday off from work and I literally spent it in bed all day in bed I was reading I was watching Netflix I was catching up on stuff and it was beautiful it was lovely I had great time but today is supposed to be like full of action you know it's like I had my one day of rest today I can do stuff and then Sunday obviously is the is essentially the admin day but that's not happening so I don't really know what's gonna happen also the reason why i slept yesterday majority of the day and just had a chill one because on tuesday we went to uh to other office which is outside of london for a company meeting and that wiped wiped me off like i was so tired and wednesday was a nightmare thursday luckily i was working from home so uh i managed but i was so ready just to rest and today I actually woke up early. I woke up at 8.15. I was just scrolling on, on the phone and had the best time. <laughs> so yeah, that was that. Um, yeah, I need to figure out kind of what we're doing today. So definitely going to gym. I think that might gonna be uh evening session. Um because the weather is really nice, it's actually sunny and the sky is blue without any clouds and i kind of want to go out but i don't really know where to go to be fair so hmm <laughs> am i gonna find a coffee shop somewhere around here which is quite nice and i can work there and i don't know i don't know we will see no. Good morning, Sunday. Yesterday after gym, I was just doing stuff for my sister a little bit from the business and then i was just chilling because i started my period and i just felt so tired so that's why i kind of slept in today as well so it's 10 45 i got up like 10 minutes ago made myself coffee i'm gonna do a bit of reading finish my coffee and then i need to do a food shop so i think i'm gonna go to different little today to spice it up um and we'll see we'll see we'll see it's gray it's quite disgusting weather today in comparison with yesterday plus i need to cook for the week i need to do all the chores and stuff but it is what it is just got back home from a food shop um and my sister gonna come over so we're gonna be actually working which would be quite nice um i got a few things in the middle so i got us each an advent calendar maltese this month because it's almost december and we haven't had um 
whoops, some flip. Uh, we haven't had an advent calendar for years, so I was like, you know, let's do that. And then I got oops, this candle, so it's leather and cedar, and it's absolutely gorgeous. So I bought it for my sister for her birthday. She's actually picking up her birthday present today, and it smells so good. And I bought it for myself this week as well, so... Yeah, highly can recommend it was £3.50 or £3.29, something like that. So definitely worth it. And so for to the top, because now there's a trend in the middle to not really fill the candles. And this is properly filled, so it looks nice. So yeah, that's what I got in the middle. And then I got a few bits from Black Friday sales. So I got um, leggings for my protein. I'm actually wearing them. At the moment because i bought them a while ago but it was like 7.99 like these ones such a uh, size, size extra large really like those so i got this one and then i have two christmas parties at work because we have like our one which is kind of with customers and it's from my company and then we have a parent company and it's kind of like the fancy posh one um so i got myself this kind of like satiny looking trousers yeah wide leg really nice quality actually went for size 22 which is usually not my size i'm usually like 18 in trousers but you know you never know with h&m so size 22 actually fits and then with it i will have this hold on let me put it the right way in um i'm gonna have this top ruched one which is quite nice and um, with the one long sleeve and cold shoulder so that's gonna be my uh, christmas outfit christmas party outfit i will get uh earrings some glittery probably long one from primark or something like that and that will be kind of it we're gonna have red lipstick i have a small kitten heels from uh Madeline, which i bought before going to korea and that will be the outfit so very easy very simple and comfy. Along the path, we realize the light peeking through the trees is coming from some sort of large house on a hill in front of us. It's still too far to see the details. New background. Uh, we finally put the tapestry on. It's not ideal, but it will do. It covers the, it covers the stain and you know it's so much better so i'm quite happy i'm pleased um i just made myself a ramen i wanted to oh my fucking arm hurts oh that's not ideal um <laughs> i wanted to order but none of the places accepting uh, orders at the moment and i'm starving so i just made ramen like fancy one put veg meat in there a bit of tofu and yeah we'll just chill now it's like nine o'clock almost We've been productive. Well, my sister was productive. She did everything she needed. I did a few bits and bobs. I edited this vlog and found music for this video. And then, you know, the ones come in because I want a bit spicing up my vlogs and make it a bit more, you know, a bit more fancy. And now I'm literally just going to enjoy ramen. going to watch a vlog from Cecil because she uploaded today, which is a surprise. And then I have another vlog from Two Hearts, One Soul. I love those two channels. I'm going to link them below if you want to check them. It's about life in Korea, which obviously I'm interested in. And yeah, then we'll go sleep because work tomorrow from home, luckily. But I'm going to go to gym in the morning. So, you know, I'm going to have quite early-ish night. So yeah, anyways, as per usual, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new here, subscribe and I see you in the next one. Bye! I'm seeing lightning where it shouldn't be I'm running